<clears throat> Alright, sorry about that. Um, hey guys, what's up? Let's do file, new source file. Now, what I'm going to be showing you is basically a um, C++ uh, source code that lets you... It, it basically deletes HAL.DLL in your System32 file, I mean folder, in Windows and hal.dll basically makes it so you're able to start up your computer without that file you uh your computer can't start i mean you can even just type delete system32 but people will notice and it'll it'll take a while so what we're going to be doing is we're going to be writing a um, code in dev c++ version 4.9.9.2 i'm going to add a description to the link and uh yeah and then i'm going to put the source code in the description uh, let's get started. All right. So you put the number side. Include that weird line, that weird arrow thing to the left. C S T D L I B, and then end. Include uh, I O stream right there. Using namespace S T D, and then line down I N T. M A I N M I mean M A I N yeah main parentheses I N T A R G C C H A R star A R G V oh that square thing you know right there yeah um then the thing next to that square thing I don't, I don't know what it is then you press enter or return if you're using a Macintosh and then it goes to the next line std colon colon remove in quotation slash slash I mean quotation C Windows system thirty two al dot dll parent and parentheses then a uh, like a colon but with like a comma in it. You know and I, I you know what I mean, like the winky face thing. Slash slash forward slash and then whatever you want to name the file. So it could be like virus. Yeah. System and this is the command the system to what to do after it's executed. Shut down minus S space minus R. So there's a space after shutdown, then space after minus S. End quotation. End parentheses, then that winky face thing again. System pause which uh it basically means stop return exit s underscore success uh winky face um basically what this does is uh and then that ends in parameters putting that thing right there you know um, basically what this does is it deletes the Windows System 32 file known as HAL.DLL which is required to start it and then it shuts down the computer and then it stops and if it works it exited and it's successful and if it worked it's successful and then it exits and uh, that's about it it's pretty easy um, it doesn't require that much time and you can probably just copy and paste the source code and there's only 12 lines in this file so uh on line four, um, yeah, that's about it. Yeah, uh, this was a collaboration video with Mech Five Six Seven and Crackhead Studios. Uh, yeah, see you around, guys.